Hello, YouTube. Welcome. Just had a little uh, a little chit chat. If you want to hear my chats, and you're watching on YouTube, too bad. Watching on Twitch. <laughs> catch catch those live on Twitch. Ooh, yes. Um, let me just flip this up real quick, and then we will get started. Um. Sorry, I need to make sure I can pull this out. Sorry, I, I'm looking down at my laptop screen and I have chat over to the left side so I can actually see it. But then I have my window open for the stream manager and game is up on the screen up top. Okay, as I said, I'm just going to be doing some, just some casual play. Uh, anybody wants to drop a comment, whatnot, they want to see something, let me know. Do some professional, do some nightmare, do some no evidence, possibly. I really like the no evidence because you really have to just know, like, what the ghost does uh, in order to see, like, all that stuff. Really cool stuff. Okay. Started. Um, and maybe Friday I might do, like, the with randoms and stuff. I, I'm just not sure how that works. Um... Because like, I know it's just in game chat, so I wouldn't be really worried about it that much. I just don't want to deal with having to uh, bring people in Discord and stuff unless, you know, they're serious and, and going to stay like the whole time. Uh, that's kind of what I'm worried about with, um, like, Among Us and the Duck Duck Goose and stuff like that. I just don't want to deal with people jumping in and out and. <sighs> Everybody knows, like, there's there's a holes out there. Um, we're just gonna keep it casual. Casual dress today. Casual play. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just kind of go through the maps. Um, kind of learn things, you know. Um, I mean, the one I like the most right now is uh, Ridgeview Court. Sorry, I gotta fix my headphones. Um, because Ridgeview Court is just kind of the. I wouldn't say the easiest map because it, it's still three. It's still the upstairs, regular floor in the basement, um, and I really hate when the ghost is downstairs. But um, it, it's it's got a guaranteed hiding spot. Like that's the biggest thing. Even on Nightmare, it has a guaranteed hiding spot uh, behind the fridge there. So that's why I really like Ridgeview Court. Um, all the other ones don't have guaranteed hiding spots. <clears throat> As if I've ever even been quick enough to use a hiding spot. But, um, yeah. I mean, we're just gonna kind of just play for fun here. Look at that, level 80. I didn't even notice that last time. Grats me. Should do that ding every time it happens. Uh, but the only thing I missed from WoW is the ding from leveling. <laughs> that game way too long. All right. Motion sensor, parabolic mic. It's Willie Nelson's um, distant cousin, Nellie Wilson. <laughs> ah, that's a good one. I think it's a good one. Quiet down, chat. <laughs> I don't care what you think. <laughs> it is funny. Oh, um, professional, right? Yeah, let's look for where the breaker is first. Bless you. For being the starting house, I don't really know the starting house. Um, okay, so it's not in the garage. It's downstairs. Great. I brought this up the last stream. Who's ever had a basement that's not creepy? Every time, it's like you go in the basement, it's just so creepy. Doesn't matter where, it's creepy. Okay, we may have found the ghost room. Yep, as it throws something. Cool. Um, Basement's over here, right? Yeah, okay. Couldn't remember this place. Ooh, bye bye. It's touching the breaker. Interesting, okay. Possible. Possible. 
Oh, Jesus Christ, that was quick. Oh my God, they're just standing right there. Ooh, okay, we know this is not a spirit. Holy Lord, this one, uh... This one's already hitting very quickly with those ghost events. We got EMF 5 already, and I didn't bring any evidence with me. That was pretty good. Uh... Wow, why does the TV look so crisp today? What the hell happened? <laughs> what, what happened? I wonder if I'm on the wrong... Uh, how does it look on stream? No, it looks fine on stream. Hmm. I don't know what's going on. Okay, uh, so we definitely got EMF 5, and it's not a spirit. Um, it's a... Uh, it's a gin possible, because actually it appeared in the living room there and did a ghost event um i believe that was a teleport because it was downstairs with the breaker for a second so i mean we might have already figured it out without even going in to figure it out <laughs> okay we need to pinpoint exactly where this ghost room is though because this thing is teleporting and actually, did it kill the breaker? Uh, let's see. No. Okay, did not kill the breaker. Okay, but it could be in here for sure. What's our cursed item? As if I really like looking for the cursed item. <laughs> Uh, yeah, could be a living room here. Okay, so it might not have teleported then. Oh, wait a minute. No, it may have teleported. Yeah. Yep, freezing temperatures. Okay, so we got freezing. And we got possible teleport. Um, okay. What else are we going to pinpoint here? Is my game audio on? I didn't even check. Uh, I, uh, give me a sign. Give me a sign. Another one. Wow. Wow. Okay. Okay. Two singing events. In there. This is a gin. It didn't eat my sanity, so it's not an oni. Like, a, that proves that one. Um, it's doing constant activity. Hmm. We've already got EMF 5, so we've already proven that. And we've already gotten freezing temperatures, so we should be able to narrow this down to nothing right now. And we narrowed it down to Jen. Wow, that was hard. Um, it's definitely not a shade. And as far as I've seen, it's not doing two things at once. It's a gin. I think we just figured this out within 10 seconds. <laughs> you know what? Let's speed run this sucker. Gin. It did do a lot of like throwing things. I did hear a lot of things happen, but that activity does not show twins. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What? <laughs> Did I just get Jeremy out of this one? Revenant? Did I not see EMF 5? I saw EMF 5. What? You... You are crazy, ghost. What? I didn't see EMF 5? I definitely saw it on there. Whoa. A Revenant did two singing events? And it was outside of its ghost room? Hmm. Wow. That one, okay. 
Interesting. I. Wow. I swear that was EMF five. Dang. Wow. Okay, I I'm gonna have to double check for EMF five because that's right. It was doing ghost events and it was only four. There's a ghost behind me. It's messing with the curtain. Mmm, it's in the kitchen. It's in the room with me. It's not a spirit. <laughs> it's a friendly spirit. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, what am I doing? Oh, I'm doing my, my favorite now, Ridgeview. Oh, it's in the base. Controller, stop it. <laughs> Dumbass. <laughs> All right. A revenant. Revenant. Two ghost. I don't think I've ever seen a Revenant do that because it did a ghost event as I was in the house, but it did a ghost event in the wrong room. Wow, that one really threw me for a loop. All right, so I'm about to double check the Revenants now. Those are really tricky. We got the mirror. All right, so we can easily figure out what this one is or where this one is. I should say where it is. And then it's a demon and it kills me immediately. You should be sorry for opening up that can of pop next to me. Hey, you're drinking my pop. <laughs> Ghost is drinking my pop. Hmm? All right, let's check for hiding. Hmm. Doesn't look like any hiding downstairs. All right. So, oh, we. Ooh, 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 you are touching doors. All right, so you touched it and closed it, okay. You are not in that room though. You are seven and a half in that room. Wonder if you're in here. Nah, you know what? I bet you you're out here. Nine, 11, seven. Mmm, you could be right here. All right, go ahead and drop those. I really hate how spooky that kitchen looks with the lights off. Spooky. Oh, I forgot to double check and make sure that my audio was on. Hold on one second. Sorry. Yes, audio is on. Okay, good. Let me pull this back up one second. Doing it again. Sorry. Okay, there we go. Um, okay, so this is kind of proved to be the best bit to start with um and then we'll bring in the crucifix because it seems like if it's gonna hunt early as a demon it's just gonna hunt early like there's nothing i can do to stop it like that's just what it does so i just have to be like real quick into a hiding spot i see a hiding spot right there and then the hiding spot in the kitchen this is why I said this is my favorite house right here. Yeah. Okay. We got the two evidences down. Oh, sorry. This was supposed to be casual. I'm supposed to be talking with a more laid back voice. Yes. I'm supposed to look for some evidence here. And uh, we're just going to turn that on there. And we're just gonna look for some uh, lovely ghost orbs here. And uh, hopefully we get some over here. And we're gonna look for some dots. Can you show me some dots, please? Okay, we're gonna have to pinpoint exactly where this guy is then. Because <laughs> I don't think he's right there. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I like these lights. Can I just take them? Bring them with me? Just throw them into the house. Nobody else is here using them. Why not? Alright, let's just drop this. Meow. And put one. Meow. That should cover enough. Oh, there goes dots. Okay, it's not a Gorio. Cool. And we pinpointed exactly where it's at. Perfect. Well, that was a lucky drop right there, and we know it is not a demon. I love it. 
very, very lovely username there, Mom. <laughs> hey, you finally got into chat. Welcome. <laughs> hmm, I wonder. Too bad today's not 13 and it's not your birthday. <laughs> All right. Uh, Raiju is a possibility. It did run very fast past those dots, um, but we do know that it's not a Gorio. That's all we've got so far. Okay, let's get back over. Um, so we don't need dots anymore. We're good there. We can go ahead and grab it and it and get back in there. Now we say we're looking good because at least we eliminated the demon. And my sanity is still quite high, so we don't have to worry about a hunt. Ooh. Stepped over here. But well, we're going to have to figure this out anyway. Are you here? Are you close? Where are you? How old are you? Where are you? Are you friendly? Where are you? Are you here? Where are you? Okay, it threw that. Um, oop, I think we know it's not ghost orbs at least, so I can go ahead and turn these lights back on to make sure I don't go insane. Keep that open because the breaker's downstairs. I could do the mirror to force a hunt and then hide. Um, that will give me Yeah, because if I force a hunt, I will pretty much know what the ghost is. Without even grabbing the other evidence, it, it will pretty much tell me what it is. But since it's a cursed hunt, it's going to go too long and is a Diogen a possibility. A Diogen is a possibility. Okay. So what that means is if I forced a cur cursed hunt and it was a Diogen and I hid in the fridge, I would die. That would be a very bad thing. So we need to eliminate that it's a Diogen. Because Diogen's no bueno for hiding. You hide, it goes right to you. Diogen knows where you are at all times. Um, so let's get fingerprints to prove that it's not a Dio. Oh, also we didn't have Spirit Box, so I don't believe it's a Dio right there. Uh... Uh, if I drop another thing, I might know if it's a Raiju. I think we're going to force a hunt as much as I don't want to. I think that might be the best bet because it's not a right. It's not a, um, uh, Diogen. Um, let's look for fingies. Shut doors. Yeah, it's walking around right next to me. So it is definitely right next to me here. Um, not seeing any fingerprints. Keep it down, you two. Seriously, we're trying to run a proper game here. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, no, I don't know if fingerprints show up there. Uh, in case anybody's wondering, and that's my wife on there and my mom watching as well. Say hi to them, everybody. Give me a sign. I'm going to need this thing to touch the door. Give me a sign. I wonder if they is a possibility. Give me a sign. Mmm. Its activity is really lowered since I've been in here. And a Thay gets weaker as you go. It's not leaving fingerprints on here, but I don't know if it can. That is the question. Give me a sign. It is so dark with just this. <laughs> no, thank you. Give me a sign. 
See, now I wonder if it's moved to that room. I mean, we could definitely double check. Just throw that there. Mmm. Yeah, it's moved. It's moved. You've moved. All right. Drop that there. Okay, so let's just move everything over here. I don't really need this, but this still helps prove that it is where it's at here. Give me a sign. I don't like that's not doing anything anymore. That's not good. Um... Yeah, because now if I force a hunt. I think the only thing I could eliminate is a Raiju because if it walks past this electronic equipment and it goes really fast and then slows down when it heads towards me. That's the only one I'll be able to figure out. God, what else can I figure out here? Oh, let me move this, this crucifix. It's not going to do any good right here. right there it's not doing anything give me a sign right in the book it's a very inactive ghost it hasn't turned off any lights really isn't doing anything give me a sign I think it's a Fae and it's aged. I think I've been in here long enough to age it. Give me a sign. Can you turn off this light? Hmm. I'm not liking this now because it's not doing anything. You know, sometimes it's, yeah, like sometimes it really sucks not to get any activity because this thing could have, ooh, this thing could have moved and that's bad. It could have hunted me and I wouldn't have been ready for it. 66%. Hasn't moved. Ooh. No, it has not moved. It's still there. Uh, smudge stick, blow out a candle. We still need those pieces of evidence. It hasn't. I mean, uh, that's a tough one to cross off there. I could try spirit box again. I could try moving the book again. Looking for EMF five. Was Wraith a possibility? Wraith is a possibility. Let's grab some salt. All right, let's do this. So before I do a cursed hunt, let's see if we can't at least eliminate a couple. Is it not doing anything? does kind of indicate that it could still be a fae. But a Dio is still up on that list. <clears throat> but the Wraith is the easiest to disprove. It is not a Wraith. Okay. It just stepped in that salt. Good. Are you here? Are you close? Um, let's do this. Are you here? Are you close? Where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Where are you? <laughs> okay, it's just walking everywhere. I mean, we've proven that it's not a wraith. That's good. Oh, ghost writing. Okay, it's a good thing I didn't uh, 
force a cursed hunt because I believe that just proves it's a Dio or a Thay. Mm. Spirit box. Ghost orbs. Ooh, this is a tricky one. Ooh, I think this is just a shy Diogen. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I think it's a shy Diogen. I can't force a cursed hunt then. I need to see if it's ghost orbs. Because <laughs> if I get a hunt and it is a Dio, I be dead. Because I. Uh, I mean, I could kite it around here. It ain't the easiest, though. Let's look for the Orbeez. Oh, yep, Ghost Orb. We got a Thay. And there you go. <laughs> and there you have it Ghost Orb, Thay. So I was right from the beginning. Hey, what do you say just for safe measure? Let's force a hunt. So here's what we're calling a D. Oops. Oops. <laughs> I broke the mirror. <laughs> so what we're going to do is just come right over here. We're going to drop my flashlight down where I can see. And I'm going to say that was stupid. Why did I do that? We're going to look in the mirror and throw it. Okay, it's done. <laughs> that was pretty good. <laughs> so what happened was I just forced a I forced a cursed hunt. Uh, I just looked into the mirror until it broke and uh, it forces a cursed hunt, which lasts uh, a minute 30. And uh, during that time, the ghost can hear me at all times. So uh, either I have to mute my mic or I have to just not say anything. Uh, that thing was so close to getting to me anyway. Like, the ghosts can see in the 360 vision. So, um, what happened was it walked into the kitchen and then it whipped something against the wall right in front of me. <laughs> but we proved it was a fay, so we all good. Uh, what happens is when you do, uh, when you look in the cursed objects and stuff, they drop your sanity. And your sanity is, like, the basically the hunt meter. If it gets down to zero, the ghost can hunt you at any time. And for a cursed object, it forces a hunt. So it was coming to kill me. But I was hiding behind the fridge. <laughs> and it whips something right against the wall in front of me. I think I might be able to clip that one. <laughs> Dang it. I can't hold on to all these things at once. Put this down. Okay. Alright, and then that was a good one. Oh, I forgot to look for the um the bone and stuff. But that's fine. That was fine. I don't remember what the Thay's ability is. Oh, the Thay ages. Yeah, I should have checked to see how much it aged. If I had the Ouija board, I could have actually asked it. Um I'm just gonna stick with Ridgeview. As I said, we're uh just keeping it casual. Hmm? All right, we're here. Take a look at the equipment and prepare accordingly before starting <laughs> the Oh, you didn't, you didn't want to... There <laughs> yeah, I would have muted the mic if I had to. <laughs> <laughs> Take a look. 
It was a good one. It whipped something right against the wall in front of me. I was just standing there and uh, I think it was a plate that just went BAM right against the wall. <laughs> Alrighty then. Uh, breakers in the basement. <laughs> Photo of the ghost. Smudge the area and blow out a candle. Ooh, we could do all three of these. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Incoming demon. E. E. Alrighty then. I do wish I could change my name on here. <laughs> Anybody knows how to do that? I think it goes by my Steam account, so I don't think I can actually change that. Yeah. Hmm. Possibly down stairs controller seriously don't do that it just randomly drifted facing straight down it's like no i don't want to look at the wall i don't want to look at the floor thank you there's that cursed chair again very scary oh jesus christ what was that <laughs> okay first floor bone the hell are you doing sitting here that was interesting oh my god okay give me Huh. Okay, vibrated a phone, so that could be in the upstairs? Or isn't there a phone over here? I think there's a phone over here. Definitely isn't one in the bathroom. I think there's a phone over here. Alright, let's start narrowing down what it could be you know what there's a phone over here in this room mm. nope okay uh, so what we're looking for with the thermometer is if any time you see that temperature drop because the ghost room is always colder than any other room. So, you basically, I mean, it's in Celsius, so it's not the easiest to figure out. But uh, when it drops to zero degrees Celsius, you know you're in the right room. It's upstairs. It's definitely in one of these rooms up here. Okay. Could be in the hallway, actually. Oh, Jesus Christ, you're right here. Freezing temperatures. So, yes, that's what you're looking for. <laughs> Thank you, ghost. Much appreciated. Okay, let's go downstairs. So now, we just need to eliminate the possibilities of what it could be. And that is no bueno with freezing temperatures because a, a demon is... Uh, freezing temperatures is one of its... Uh, uh, evidences. Evidence, I. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um. Let's see. Can we eliminate anything else? I mean, that probably. Not really doing the twin spike. I, I kind of looked into that. It's not really the twin spike there. So let's just go ahead and do my usual. Do that. Um. Uh, actually, let's bring one with us. Bring this one just because the demon is still on the board. Okay. Just hearing things probably just in my head. Okay. So with the crucifix, what we watch for is if it burns, like you'll see it catch on fire. And if it does that at any point right now, then we know it's a demon because demons can have the ability to be able to hunt at all times. Thank you. Um, that was EMF two. And it's messing with the lights. Oh my God. I should take a picture of that. <laughs> wow, that is creepy. Okay, let's do this. Oop, you're out here now. You are 
not a mayor. Okay. The mayor has an ability which is like 66% to flip the light switch back off as soon as you turn it on, so... I don't think freezing temperatures is a mayor anyway, but that eliminates that one. Try to pinpoint things without having to actually uh, deal with them. Okay, yeah, it, the mayor's not possible. It's right here. Um, okay, so let's figure this out. So it was freezing temperatures so far. There's not a whole lot of activity. And my sanity bar looks okay. Okay, so we're going to have to just bring the next sets of evidence. And see if we can't find a ghost orb. And get ghost writing. Freezing temperatures again. Um, ghost orbs. Okay, it is not a demon. Demons do not have ghost orbs. All right. At least I think they don't have ghost orbs. No, they do not have ghost orbs. Okay, so we're looking at these four. Uh, Revenant, Yure, Hantu, and Anrio. Okay, so Anrio has the ability to block candles. Uh, so if you do three candles, it forces a hunt. So um, there's one way to figure him out right away. Um, the Hantu is the cold temperature, so it's going to be killing the breaker every so often, which it hasn't killed the breaker yet. So, so far, it is not that one. And the Yure is the sanity one, but it hasn't done a ghost event yet. So, if it does a ghost event and my sanity dips by 20% instead of the usual 10% during a ghost event, then we know it's a Yure. And Revenant's an asshole. We know that. Revenant's already eluded me on the first hunt. <laughs> the only thing with the Revenant is that it is slow when hiding, when you're hiding. And then it goes at you like a bat out of hell. Okay, so if we see dots, then we know what it is right away. But we're also looking, the book is sitting right there. I think it's just out of camera range, though. But you can see it pop up and float if it is ghost riding. Okay, we don't need to look at that anymore because we've seen it's ghost orbs. Now, I think because we had freezing temperatures, it can't be a mimic. Though I don't quite know how that one works completely. I'm not seeing dots. And it's definitely in that room if it keeps hitting that. Okay. Um, not dots. Yeah, I figured that would just eliminate the URA. Um... The only way to test the on Rio is if I'm actually in the room with it or not in the room with it in the area with it so I can see it blow off the candles. And then Revenant is fingerprints or EMF five. Revenant is Revenant is ghost writing. OK, so we're going to bring fingerprints up there. Oh, if it's an on Rio, we're in trouble. That's one of the objectives. Get a ghost to blow out a candle. Hmm. Are the ghosts ever dangerous? Very. Always dangerous. Um, the only thing that's protecting me right now is the sanity meter. Um, each ghost has an ability to hunt at a certain amount. Typically, it's 30%. So if that ever hits 30%, it can hunt me and kill me at any, at any time then. Uh, but each ghost has their own little thing built in. The Hantu, I believe, is the cold one. Um, it can hunt at 60% in a cold room. So if it were to kill the generator or kill the breaker, 
it could hunt me at 60% instead of 30%. The other two ghosts are 30%. So right now I have that as a buffer zone before they can hunt. Um, but right now, let's do this, do that, and we'll get our last evidence here. I actually don't think I can have that. <laughs> That's scary. Yes, why do you think I have the uh, the pulse meter going? <laughs> because there's times that this thing will jump scare you and it can turn and come after you. Uh, give me a sign. Thank you. Ooh, where was that? Oh, 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 it's touching everything. Where was that? Oh, jeez. I didn't hear what headphone that was in. This door? Doesn't appear to be fingerprints. You know what? Here, let's close this. Let's... Controller. Okay, let's do this. So we can test for non real Not seeing it. Give me a sign. Yes, I know freezing temperatures. Thank you. Thank you. You are not fingerprints. That would have shown up. Okay, so there's some ghosts that can hide their fingerprints. The ones that we have right now cannot. Let's try this one. Are you here? Are you close? Where are you? How old are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Where are you? Where are you? Okay, I don't believe it's that one. It's messing around with this room over here now. Are you here? Okay, no. Okay. So... That didn't give me much. But what I know for sure is that it's not fingerprints. Because those two ghosts cannot hide fingerprints. Mm, that really sucks. Ugh. If I could find the cursed object, I could force a hunt, and then we could figure out if this is a revenant. Or actually, you know what? We could prove either way. Because if it's very slow, if you, you could be able to hear the footsteps. If it's very slow, we know it's a revenant. If it's normal speed, we know it's an unreal. Hmm. We can definitely figure this one out. Um, what can we do? It's probably, yeah, it's between ghost writing and spirit box. The two that they're not giving me right now. Okay. Let's do this. Let's do this. Um... Okay, so these two, I'm not really worried about my sanity for them. So let's just load up, grab the candle. Um, forget the book. Forget the crucifix. Let's bring the candle. I have a feeling this is going to help the most. It's one thing that built into the game that if you have a candle on you, uh, you do not lose sanity. As long as you have it lit, you cannot lose sanity. And there's one ghost, which is what we're trying to prove right here, that will aim for candles. It hates fire, so it tries to blow it out at all times. And if it blows out three of them, which I think we might have just figured out that it is indeed an Unreal. Oops. Stop that, idiot. Stop it. <laughs> All right. Pick. Oh my god. Pick up the lighter. I can't see it. There we go. Okay. I'm thinking it's an Unreal. I really am because. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Stop it. I'm just going to have it blow it out one more time. And then what I think I'm going to do is run down, well, and then what I'm going to do is stand right here, have the lighter on me, and book it downstairs. Because if it blows out the lighter on me, it can hunt. And if it hunts, we know it's an Unreal.
I do, oh, you know what? I do have the crucifix down. So I should be safe from the unreal hunt. In theory. Come on. What was the other one? Was it fingerprints? Oh, there's two. Okay. Let's get ready to run. <laughs> Because it could hunt in any sanity if it blows it out. I run it downstairs at the fridge. Oh my god, you scared the hell out of me. Don't do that. Come on, baby, give me it. Yes, I, I, I heard it. I didn't see it, I heard it. Come on. Heart's racing now. <laughs> the pulse thing hasn't caught up to me. Okay, ghost event. Whoa, that was a spooky one. Whew, spooky ghost. Whew. Jesus Christ. <laughs> All right, candles blown. Candles blown out. Wait for it. Did not attempt to hunt. Okay. It didn't attempt to hunt. Interesting. Okay. Oh. Okay. It didn't hunt. It's a revenant. That sanity prove anything? I don't think so. I don't think that sanity proves anything. I think it was because it hit me with the ghost event. Welcome back. There's some jobs ready for you. I don't know why I ran into the ghost event. I should have just backed off and let it finish. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, that was definitely a revenant. I mean, I could have forced a, a, a hunt and then you would have heard it go really slow, but mm, I didn't do the uh, other two things. I should have brought a camera with me, but I wanted to do the, um, the candle hunt. I wanted to try to get the candle hunt to happen, and it didn't happen, so we knew what it was right there. That was pretty good. Alrighty then. We've arrived. Check the equipment and get set up before investigating. <sighs> Alright. Just some uh, casual ghost hunting here. Oh, this is an easy one, except for the prevent a ghost from hunting one. Hmm. Oh yeah. All right. Let's bring our normal stuff. Uh, you lose all your equipment, so you don't lose money and stuff. You lose your equipment, and the contract's over unless you try to take a wild guess and get it right. Lose all your equipment, so you lose all whatever money it it costs to rebuy. So it's uh. It's kind of a, uh, you kind of call it a, um, oh, I can't even think of what those games are called. It has a name for it and I can't remember. <laughs> a roguelike. It's a roguelike game that you just lose everything and then you buy it again and you continue again. But since it's just like all randomized, like it's. It's a lot better than a roguelike, at least I, I I figure it's a lot better than a roguelike. 
because like the definition of a roguelike is uh, you die, that's it. Like you have to completely start the game over and everything. But with this, I didn't even look to it. It's the uh, breakers downstairs. Um, with this, all you do is pretty much lose the money that, you know, you spend on the equipment. But I only had, um, I've only had, what, three hunts? I mean, I just forced that one. Three hunts, four hunts, something like that. So I haven't lost pretty much anything. It's down here with me. I don't like it when it's downstairs with me. Uh, I really hate it when it's down here. You bastard. You have to be downstairs, don't you? Uh, I... The basement's not a bad area to be because there's some hiding spots and stuff. Um, but yeah, I pretty much have to run upstairs, so that sucks. Because my preferred hiding spot is over there. Um, okay. So the basement's kind of nice because you can set up uh, a camera on each side, have it face each other, and then you'll always catch dots and ghost writing and anything like that. Hmm. So while it sucks, it ain't bad. It's better than having it be like in that laundry room on like Willow, Willow Street or um, Tanglewood because it's like a really small room and you can't put a camera there. Um, get in the truck and leave. Yeah, I tried to do that the first game we ever played. Uh, when, it, when Richard and I chopped in, I said, nope, we're done. It's like, nope, we're done. We'll just take a guess. We're good. <laughs> we said, we out. <laughs> All right, let's put this right here. That right there. Sucks is we're gonna have to turn off the lights and it turns off all the lights. So we'll grab a second camera and we'll do the same with the dots on the opposite side. And then we'll bring in the crucifixes and we'll blah 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 blah. I think I'm gonna throw these at the entrance of the house just to make sure. Save me some trouble. So we'll just do this. Yeah, I was trying to run fast again. Uh, 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 just throw these here. We're just going to grab everything just so it's a little bit quicker. So I don't have to run back to the truck. Oh, while we're in here. Let's flip on the camera. Look for some dots. Hydrate break as soon as I find my water. Dots it is. Okay, so when we go back down there, we'll have to make sure if we actually see dots or not. Because if we don't see dots, then we know for sure it's this guy right here. But dots is good. Dots is very good. Dots is one of my favorite um, uh, evidences. Because it disproves the demon right away. So let's go ahead and load up another camera. I don't know why I did Every other contract, I accidentally bring four tripods. Why did I bring three cameras and only two tripods? I don't know what I did there. All right, let's grab ghost writing and bring the camera. Empty hand, that's right, empty hand. So it Dio is still possible. So we do have to watch out for a Dio. What's good is that we can kind of peek around, look for ghost orbs. And uh, check for dots at the same time here. I think it's actually on this side over here. So let's point this over here. 
And let's do that here. But the dots did go off, so we did see that. Let's see if we see dots while we're standing here. Right in the book, right in the book, right in the book. Uh, give me a sign. We need to get the um, thingy prints. All right, I'm not seeing dots, um, but that's not disproving it yet. So we're going to grab the second dots. <laughs> oh, in order to, uh, in order to follow, are you on the, um, are you on the app or are you on, because if you're on, on the app, you have to touch the video and it, it'll pull it up and then you could hit follow. It's like the little heart. Uh, Cause right now all you're looking at is the chat. So it has like the video and the chat underneath it. So what you have to do is touch the video like you would to pause and then you hit like the little heart in case you didn't see that. That kind of goes for everybody. It's a little heart. It, it looks like a little heart and it says follow. You touch that little thing and it goes bing. And I say, yay, thank you for following. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> Thank you, A1354, for following. <laughs> I think I have to be careful saying that because that's uh, an important number. <laughs> you, you don't say that out loud. <laughs> or should I should I do it like a phone number? 813-1954. <laughs> Um, okay, let's grab fingerprints and spirit box. I think, oh, hold on. Wraith is a part of a possibility, isn't it? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. I like a wraith. I like wraiths. Wraiths are cool. Wraiths suck when you're playing with somebody else because they teleport and they do a ghost event and then they hunt. They can do it all at once. Was that upstairs? Definitely heard that upstairs. Uh, give me a sign. Was that over here? See, the problem with the basement is it's tough to find fingerprints. Ah, that wasn't the sign I wanted to see. I was hoping it didn't do that. Mm. Okay, well, that's eliminated a couple of ghosts right there. That's a visual bug, right? That looks like a visual bug. Can you shut this door? Give me a sign. Give me a sign. Yeah, that's a visual bug. Okay, that's that's what I thought. Um, hmm, okay. Well, it's not touching that, so let's... Oh, I don't want to do this. Are you here? Are you close? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Where are you? Are you friendly? Where are you? Where are you? How old are you? Don't think it's Spirit Box, but it was having trouble hearing me. Hmm. I think my sanity's kind of dipped too, so we're gonna have to deal with that first. Okay. So what happened was it showed dots while we were down there, so it's not a Gorio. Um. But that's pretty much all I got from that. And that stinks. That really stinks. So I'm probably going to have to go down and uh, turn off those lights. There goes dots again. So ride, ride is a possibility, is it not? I think it is. And that thing just bolted. Uh, that was ghost orbs, though. 
Yeah, that thing just bolted across the um, uh, electronics, and a Raiju speeds up around electronics. Um, okay, freezing temperatures. Okay, so we got our ghost orb. So we just need to see if it's going to write in that book. Smudge stick. Ghost presence with a motion sensor. Um, we could test for the Banshee scream. Prevent it from hunting with a crucifix. And then ghost writing. Okay, um, let's bring these two. I don't think any of these are going to be dangerous anymore. I don't think it's a Thay because it hasn't really done a whole lot. The Yokai is the dumbass ghost. It's referred to as such because what it does is when it hunts, it can't hear anything unless it's right next to you. And you can yell at it and then it will come to you. So that one I'm not really worried about. Okay, so it's near this light switch. So we're just listening for whispers. Uh, I've also brought this with me, so go ahead and put that down. Not sure what that sound was. Okay, so it's right here. That's good. So what's neat about this uh, game and stuff, it, this is still early access. Like, this has been early access for a year and a half or so now, or almost two years. That thing is bolting through those electronic equipments. Um, so there's like a really big update planned really soon that they haven't really seen, said when it's going to be, um, but it's, that thing went right past that motion sensor, but a lot of the, like, this equipment and stuff is going to change. I think that lowers my sanity a little bit each time, so I think we're going to back out. I am not getting anything on the parabolic mic. Oh, um, okay, so it's done nothing. I haven't detected the ghost presence with the motion sensor either, but it, there it goes. Okay, now you do it. <laughs> yeah, it's going slower each time it passes certain things, um, and that was just a glow stick that it passed. So, a Raiju is a possibility, but what is the Raiju's thing? It is not freezing temperatures. There's no way in hell. It is not ghost riding. Yeah, okay, we can eliminate that one. I think it's fingerprints for a Banshee. EMF 5. EMF 5. This thing has done nothing, though. Um. Okay, it ain't a Banshee. As far as I've seen, it's not a Banshee. But that thing is bolting across that, and I think it does actually affect it. I think it does. What I'm referring to, sorry, is the Raiju's ability, um, which they say it's just during hunts, is that if you have electronic equipment that's on or on the ground, anytime it passes by it, it speeds up. Because you notice how slow it just went right there, just walking across the glow stick. But then when it walks across, like right in the middle of there, I have a thermometer on and then I have the EMF reader in the back there. But I have the thermometer on and the dots projected right in the middle. So when it crosses the middle of the screen, it seems to go really fast. And I don't think that's just random.
I really don't think that's just random. But I could be wrong, because that just went a little bit faster there. Um, so what do we need to just eliminate this? It's spirit box, fingerprints, or EMF5. Fingerprints, spirit box, EMF5. Okay, let's get this one done. We got to get this one right. We've already gotten the other ones right, but still. <laughs> we got to get this one right, too. Fingerprints, spirit box, EMF5. So let's just do EMF5. I, I believe it's going to be EMF5. You see how much slower it walked there. Ooh. It wasn't freezing time. It was fingerprints. So let's bring this one. I don't really like that one, but let's bring it anyway. It's just the UV light. It's just harder to see. <clears throat> Did it turn the light on? Yeah, it can turn the light on and off as as at will. Um, I don't know if I left this light on. But uh, what it's doing is walking past this. So the motion sensor triggers and the light gets really bright. Um, okay, because it's not touching doors. Give me a sign. It's doing everything else except for what I would like it to do. Like, I need it to touch this door. I need it to open this. I need it to do something that will show. When does that sound? It's like a little beat or something. It's like it's hitting something. Yeah, every single time. It's like it's hitting something. I'm not quite sure what that is. Can you give me a sign? Okay, thank you. That's the sign I needed. Okay, it's not fingerprints. And it's not EMF5. Oh, man. I don't believe any of those ghosts could hide, hide the fingerprints. So we do know that it's not fingerprints then. Man, oh man. Hmm. Oh my god, I completely forgot to put these in there. <laughs> um, oops. Oopsies. That's right. I. I didn't even realize I didn't have these things with me the entire time. Oopsies. That, I wouldn't even have known <laughs> that it would have hunted. Whoops. Okay, now I feel safe. That was stupid. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. And here I was running around all willy-nilly. Give me a sign. It keeps hitting something. What the hell is that sound? This ghost is pissing me off. <laughs> you hear me? Pissing me off. May have to force a hunt again. This is crazy. It's doing nothing. How am I getting Casper the Friendly Ghost over and over again? Cleanse the area near the ghost with a smudge stick. Okay, well, I can do that for the bonus objective at least. But it ain't fingerprints. It's not angered by me. It's the one I said it was in the beginning. It has to be. It has to be Spirit Box or EMF 5. And it's just an asshole. Hmm. Hmm. Um, let's bring this. Let's just go ahead and smudge the area. I guess grab the mirror, force a hunt. Uh, 
I mean, it, it didn't give me anything else. It's a very timid ghost. Give me a sign. Keeps hitting stuff over here. All right, let's try this. Let's just smudge. All right. Um. I the only other thing I got to be able to prove what this thing is is to uh, force a hunt. Let's see if I'm actually looking in the right area for it. I am. I am right in the right area for it. Okay, so it is there. Um, it's worse a hot. Yeah, it's definitely standing right there. I was in the right area. Okay, here it goes. You gotta be quiet. Shh. Okay, um, that could be another freaking revenant. That thing was very slow. That thing was extremely slow. It did not walk faster at any time, and it walked up extremely slow. Did we? It, uh, did we hear faster footprints when it started? I don't know if I heard it go do 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 and then go do 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 or was it just do 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 the entire time? Let me see. Okay, with those two pieces of evidence, no, it is a raiju. Okay, because a raiju speeds up when it crosses electronic equipment and it slows down at any other time. So that was extremely slow. Oh shit, you know what? Oh, oh damn, I was in the ghost room for a long time. Oh. Oh, that makes sense. Oh, it makes sense, it's a Thay. Because a Thay ages and slows down as time goes on. It did not speed up, it stayed the same speed. It's a Thay. What is the Thay's? Fingerprints, right? No. Ghostwriting? It's just not writing the book. The two books, it is just not writing in that book. Because it was so slow. And with those two pieces of evidence, it cannot be anything else other than a Raiju. But a Raiju goes really fast and then goes regular speed. At least, at least I'm, how I'm understanding. I think, I think it's a thay. I think we call it a thay. Yes. And I would not have figured that one out if it wasn't for that hunt. I would not have figured that one out. That was beautiful. Beautiful. So let's see exactly how much it aged. So it ages like, I think it's like five years or something like that. 
So its ability was, oh God, yes. Okay, so this thing starts out, I think it's like, starts out at like 19 years old or something like that. So it starts out like extremely quick and it will sprint. And then each time it ages, its ability it's used, uh, it ages five years. So it ended up like 59 or 60 or something like that. So that was a slow ghost at that point. <laughs> Happy birthday eight times. Let's see, time it goes through. Yeah, eight minutes. Okay, so it's every minute it ages. I like a Fey. Uh, the one I don't like so far is Mare. Mare's the one that's killed me the most. <laughs> All right, I've got uh, time for maybe two. Maybe two more. Do at least... Uh, at least another one. Yeah, so I've only gotten one wrong. It's been the Revenant in the start, and that was like a, a throw-off. Like, that was... It did something. And, uh, like, it showed up as an EMF-5. I had that activity meter, and it, like, stayed there for a few minutes. And usually, when it does that, that's a guarantee that's EMF-5. But then that would eliminate the Revenant. Cool, it's in the garage. Uh, motion sensor, EMF, and repel. Okay, that's the tricky one. It's a mare. It's a mare. It's messing with light switches. It's a mare. <laughs> oh, I can't wait till this game gets updates. <laughs> Wish the ghosts were easier to see. They are. There are some of them that are very easy to see. Um... If you watch, I mean, like, if you start, if you watch the first three videos that I put out, um, you'll see a lot of the ghost because I was an idiot and I ran into him most of the time. Um, and then during some ghost events, like, I uh, was it yesterday's? I can't remember if it was yesterday's or I don't know because some of my other ones, um. Some of my other videos, I had some really good, like, I saw the ghost. Uh, a lot of jump scares and stuff, so. Um, the only issue I really have is that the ghosts flash. And it's meant to make it more difficult to be able to get away from them. Like, they'll flash, they disappear, reappear in front of you as you're going. And a couple of the ghosts actually are visible the most. And then they kind of flash, and then they go back in. And uh, during ghost events, they're completely visible the entire time. And those are usually like the jump scares. But yeah, I I told myself like when I started streaming that I would absolutely not play this game until I got 50 followers and I got affiliate because I knew this game would freak the hell out of me. But after playing it with um uh with Richard and Alex I had so much fun that I decided, well, I'll go ahead and stream a solo. And as long as I was like either like talking to somebody or like kind of figure I'm talking to somebody. Like this game gets me talking. Let's put it that way. This game gets me talking because it gets me nervous and like you're always on edge. So it kind of gets it gets your blood pumping and then it's really fun like as a detective game because that's what you're doing is you're going into each house and you're trying to prove okay this is what the ghost is and stuff and uh doing like zero evidence and stuff i mean that's fun it's really hard to figure out but it's fun like it's enjoyable figuring out like this is where the ghost is this is what it's doing it, it is it is kind of clue it's it's kind of a um Kind of like an interactive version. There is a game um, that this was actually based off of. Oops, it's upstairs. Yeah, it's upstairs. I heard that. Um, so this was actually based off of. Oh, what the heck was it? What the hell was that? What the hell? It killed the breaker. Okay. Um, this was based off of another computer game that was like really old and stuff, uh, but I can't remember what it was called. Um, okay, so we've, is he playing? No, not right now. No, it's just me. 
Um, so we've already eliminated that as a gen. Gins cannot shut off this breaker. And I gotta say, I already do not like this ghost because I hate it when they turn off the breaker. And that sound is the radio upstairs, so we might know where it's at. It's definitely one of these rooms. Stop messing with that, please. You're annoying. Stop it. Freezing temperatures. Freezing temperatures, we just saw our breath. All right, we know where it is. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Give me a sign. This one is quite active. Um, ugh, quite active and in the hard room to figure out. Um, that was just hard to angle a camera into. <clears throat> it shutting off the breakers though, and it being cold. It is not a mare though. Um, interesting, I thought the mare does that. It is not a shade. Well, actually, you know what? I take that back. It could be a shade. I'm leaning more towards this one, though, the more I. So, we're going to need this thing to do stuff, of course. <laughs> uh, 86. I mean, that's fine. We're, we're looking okay. Um, EMF, smudge stick, and motion sensor. Okay, so let's just grab... The basic equipment. As I said, this is just a casual cream. Uh, stream cream. Casual cream. Wow. I'm tired. Uh, a casual stream. So we're just going to uh, grab the camera. And we'll just grab the dots projector there. Oh, yes. And we'll just go upstairs. And we'll drop the camera there. We'll just get a uh, camera up there. And we'll look for some ghosty orbs here. We're just uh, looking for some orbs. Yeah, as I said, this room kind of sucks. Yes, yeah, freezing temperature again. Um, not seeing ghost orbs, but not ruling out ghost orbs either. Oh my God, you're in here now. Okay. Um. Mm. Oh my god. Whew. Um what I'm worried about right now is that demon is still on that list and I haven't seen ghost orbs because ghost orbs eliminate demon. And as I said before, demon can hunt at all times. Um but a demon prefers to hunt at 70% or lower. <clears throat> so as long as I keep that higher than that, kind of okay, but it's no guarantee. So now I'm just looking for the dots uh, in the orbs. Either one would be fantastic. If neither one shows up, then this could definitely be a demon. But a demon could have hunted, like, as soon as I walked into the house. I had that happen on part 10? I want to say part 10, because I think that's the one that I posted with the terror roulette. Which was oh so perfect. And yet the short only got a thousand views. I, I don't know. I don't know. It was so perfect. Okay, I'm not seeing ghost orbs, and I'm not seeing dots. Oh, this is a butt. This is a butt. Mmm. What really sucks about this list is that demon is on there. And with it flipping off the breaker, the Moroi is faster in the cold. Right? Let me make sure I have that remembered correctly. 
No, Moroi is the one that curses you. Okay, never mind. Okay, Moroi I'm not as worried about. Okay, uh, this is the one I'm worried about. Because the Mimic, without it being Ghost Orbs, uh, Mimic has to be Ghost Orbs. Like, it would have to show up. Uh, a Mimic can pretend to be any ghost. And it's not just one ghost. It can pretend to be all ghosts, but it has to give ghost orbs. So if we don't see ghost orbs, it's not a mimic. That is its force piece of evidence. However, it could be moving too, because I am on professional. But so far, I don't think it's that. Um, now, shade. I'm more so thinking it's that one. Uh, a shade just won't interact with anything as I'm in the room with it. So, it, shade's not that easy to figure out. It's not killing the breaker or anything, so it's not doing, like, main activity. It is messing with electronics like crazy, though. Knock it off, please. Thank you. Alright. The reason why I run out of the room so quickly is because... Um, you lose sanity as you're in a dark room. Like, any dark room. Like, if I run into this hallway here, like right here, I'd be losing sanity. So what you have to do is stay near the lights. I didn't bring fingerprints, did I? Son of a... Moran, Moran. Did we see what the cursed item was? No, we didn't. Um, If it's tarot cards, it's right here. Oh, son of a bitch. <laughs> Ooh, I can do tarots. Ew. So the tarot cards have, I think it's 12 possibilities. Something like that. Oh, is that EMF 5? No, that is four. Okay. Um, so the tarot cards are one of the cursed items. And they have a one in, I think it's a one in 12 chance of getting any of them. And <laughs> I don't want to spoil it, but part 10 is so funny. Because I pulled the 1% chance and died immediately. The hanged man is the, uh, 1% chance. So it has like 12 cards. Hangman is immediate death. Um, there's the priestess, high priestess, which gives you an extra life so that you could actually, you know, die from the ghost and then it respawns you right back. Uh, and then there's like, it gives you 25% sanity. It takes away 25% sanity. Gives you 100. Gives you zero. Um, makes the ghost interact. Makes the ghost do an event. Makes the ghost hunt. There's a bunch of different things that tarot cards have. Um, and so far, I've only pulled um, two cards out of the tarot, tarot deck entirely in all the playthroughs I've done. And so far, I've pulled Death and I've pulled the um, Hanged Man. Video buffered twice. That would be your internet. <laughs> I have zero drop frames. I am looking okay on my end, but thank you. Um, what else can we figure out? I mean, we, well, we, we do need fingerprints. So yeah, let's do that. What is my sanity at? Hmm. With the demon still on the board, let's take sanity pills. Let's take sanity pills. Cause yeah, I'm on fiber. So if I have dropped frames, it's the game. And that's pretty much the only reason why I would have dropped frames. But yeah, you, you'll see that. If a streamer ever has drop frames, that's what they call it. Um, That would be like the little buffering on your phone. That's what you would see. Give me a sign. It would kind of lag. Are you here? Yes. Thank you. That's a good one. 
That is a good one. Spirit box is wonderful. Okay, so we've narrowed it down to Moroi or twins, and it is not interacting in two places at once. It is not giving ghost orbs. Give me a sign. I want it to open a door. Let's close these doors. So, um, I think it's the Moroi. It has a chance to slam the doors. That was in another room, wasn't it? I, I heard that from this room. Give me a sign. That's the thing, it could one it could wonder. Wonder. Never ever stop wondering. Thank you, Blippy. You just <laughs> blown in my head. <laughs> Give me a sign. It could be wandering uh between this room and that room over there. Because it's definitely walking this hallway. What happens is if you see the lights flicker, that means it walked right next to the uh, light switch. So it hasn't done it right now, but I heard that throw from the other room. Uh, give me a sign. I think I might have just had a drop frame there. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. It flipped the switch and then did a um, breath. So, I think it just cursed me. So, let's go see. The reason why they didn't scare me is because I saw that midair. <laughs> So what it did was it's a ghost breath event. And that one was not scary because it definitely cursed me. Let's see. <laughs> Go to sleep, OB5. Well, thank you for thank you for popping on, give it a chat. Have a good night. <laughs> I think I've already proven what this one is. Just going to watch the sanity for a second. Because if it doesn't dip, then that was not a Moroi curse. Mm, it's floating in between. Ugh, I really think it was a Moroi. What was I at? I was at eight. Wait a minute. I took pills, didn't I? I did take pills. Let's see. Moroi is the one that. Yeah, they did the curse. Absolutely. Because it's like 20% and then your sanity keeps dipping. <clears throat> okay, so let's just double check for ghost orbs. really have not seen so uh, I'm definitely thinking it's it's the Moroi what else can I double check for to prove that it is a Moroi ghost writing uh, and fingerprints ghost writing and fingerprints motion sensor Ghost writing fingerprints motion sensor. Okay. Um, fingerprints and motion sensor. I already have most of the stuff in there. Smudge when it's chasing somebody. Okay, well, we're not worried about um this thing hunting anytime soon. Which is good. Turning on that freaking radio. I really do not like that you keep doing that. Yes, I know freezing temperatures. Thank you. Okay. Drop that right there. Drop it like it's hot. 
Yeah, you ain't fingerprints. Hey, why'd you throw this cup over here? Punk. Alright. Yeah, so I mean, that backs up my claim that it is not fingerprints. Hold on. Hold on. That looks like EMF 5. Oh, no. Oh, man. Is that EMF 5? Oh, it's possible. And if it is, it's twins. Oh, no. Oh, I was about to call it on Moroi. Could it be twins? I don't think it can be. I really don't think it can be. Uh, just when I thought I got out, they pull me back in. Uh, what else can we do? Um, I mean, other than look for fingerprints, you suck. You suck, you jackass. Ah, <sighs> turned off the freaking breaker again. My God, knock it off. Okay. Okay, yes. You're twins. You are twins because you killed the breaker and then you also hit the radio. Stop being so spooky. Stop it. Stop. Stop it. Stop being so spooky. Spooky, 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 spooky. Give me a sign. Give me a sign. You're the Spider Man. Uh. Broke a light. Bastard. It didn't give me my five though. Shit. I was hoping that would trigger EMF five. The way that this thing is interacting. Oh, it cursed me. There ain't no way it didn't. EMF five. You're you're giving me this evidence when I'm out in the truck. Oh. I mean, it sat there on EMF five. It has to be EMF five. I mean, come on, it, it has to be EMF five. But it, it turned that on. Oh, sorry. Oh my god, I just... It has to be a Moroi. But it's doing two things at once. A oh, Moroi is coast riding. This, this thing is the most... Oh my god, I had the camera on me. Why did I not take a picture? Uh, I, uh, this one's killing me. This one really is. 
I am just so lost in what to search for now. Where did I throw my EMF reader? Did I throw it in front of the ghost? Oh my god. <laughs> there it is. Okay. Ugh. I'm done with you. I'm done with you. You have interacted with so many things at the same time. You have to be twins. You're just not giving up EMF 5. It, it's just, it's bolting all over the freaking place. Ugh. <sighs> And then ghostwriting, and it hasn't written in the book. It can't be ghostwriting, it can't be. I think I'm calling it there. I'm getting hot. I think I got time for one more. This is Moroi, or it's twins, and it's driving me mad. I was right that it was 20% that it hit me with. But it... See, it killed the breaker, and then it did that radio at the same time. I should have... I should have just called in a Moroi. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. Well, it's two that throw me for a loop. The Revenant and that one. All right. This is going to be the last one. Do a little bit of a quicker one here. I am roasting hot. <laughs> it is hot in here. Oh, did my... Hold on. One second. Sorry. No, everything's still on. Okay. Take a look. You may be able to use it to okay. Um, we may actually just run and grab that cursed item and uh, use it and die. Because I am ready for bed at this point. Just uh, having a little casual phasmophobia. That's a fun. This was fun. Learned a bit about the, uh, the hunts. Like, we actually did a couple hunts, so... Ugh. Why is it break great to be downstairs? Um, but yeah, I am well aware that I'm up against uh, a really big streamer. <laughs> As I say, I'm not up against them. Like, everybody is uh, playing for fun and stuff. And, you know? We're having fun. That's, that's the main point. It's the reason why I started all this is... to have fun making money secondary stuff you know nice side income I mean if it gets to that point but we'll have fun okay ghost could be down here uh, hmm. give me a sign Upstairs. Do I hear that radio again? Are you serious? Give me a sign.
Not hearing anything. Taking your keys. Uh, sink. Right over here. Hey. Hey. You shut that off really quick. Oh my god, you are whipping stuff all over me. Holy lord. So you're over here? But you're not. Huh. Give me a sign? It's not pinpointed to this bathroom, though. Give me a sign. Hmm. It definitely did stuff over here, though. Like, it was whipping things around here. Was it whipping things in here? No. Can you give me a sign? You know what? I wonder if it was in here. Yeah. Alright. Give me a sign. Yeah, it could have been stuff in here. This is sitting right there. Let's see. Eleven five. Here we go. Nine. Okay, so touch me. Not noni. Fucking breath. All right, it's in here, but it looks like it's back towards the back of the garage. Okay. Yeah. Bastard, taking 10% of my sanity away. Mmm. Lovely sunset. Mmm. That took away a lot more than just 10% of my sanity. That took away 30% of my sanity. Really? Do you, do you think? I it's a possibility. It's a high possibility. That is a very high possibility. Hmm. Did we get it just by finding its room? You know what? What time is it? Uh nah, we'll go we'll go for one more evidence. I don't want to go that crazy. We'll go for an evidence. Let's grab our stuff and throw it in there. So I definitely think it's in the back of the garage there. <sighs> okay, it's in the back of the garage there, yes. Don't do that. Don't do that. That is scary. Okay, that covers that area. And that covers that area. Okay, you're interacting with things and I don't have anything with me, so that's not very nice. Just turn that off. Close that. Okay. Okay, I didn't see the cursed item either, so... I don't know if I have one right now. Uh, EMF five. It is not a Moroi. Mm. Yeah, I don't think that's true. I don't think that's true. 
I don't think that's a true EMF-5 then. Okay, let's do our standard affair here. Yeah, because I don't think that was a true EMF-5. Because I'm pretty sure that this is a uh, Moroi. Okay, so we're going to have to drop this camera. Probably in this corner here. That's the best view. Drop that right there. And then let's do EMF. Give me a sign. Can you give me a sign? We do have hiding spot right here. Give me a sign. I'm not getting freezing temperatures. Hmm. I didn't see any EMF there, which that gives me nothing. Okay. Um. Grab our standard stuff here. I know I didn't shut off that light, but I'm gonna drop the other evidence first before I shut off the light. Just doing some casual searching. Hello, F-Man 9364. F-Man? F-Man? Oh. <laughs> How are you doing today? I'm just uh, doing some casual phasmophobia here. Uh, you're looking for this ghost. It's in the garage right now. It's uh, hiding in between a couple of cars. It has uh, hit the alarm already once, so it's panicking. It's scared. It's running. It's now running out to the truck. No, oh, never mind. Not at all. <laughs> already then. Fireman. Okay, I can do that. Did you open that one? No, no, no. You're back over here. Okay, you're opening. Oh, hello, Dots. Hello, hello. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Are you here? Are you? Oh, my God in heaven. <laughs> wow. He, um... He was pissed, but he said far. There's no way. He's right there. <laughs> He's there. How was that far? Spirit box and dots. Ooh, yucky. Okay. Um Timmy. It was a Timmy. <laughs> Ooh, I don't like the possibilities of this one. Just being a Dio. I just don't know where to run. <laughs> I don't think it's breathing temperatures. Uh, and I don't think it's fingerprints. So there's that at least. I eliminated the Moroi, didn't I? Yes, I did. Okay, let's do the Wraith check and look for ghost orbs. Let's see. I actually don't think it can be ghost orbs with those two a combination. But it's saying far. I wonder if it moved rooms. I don't like it if it moved rooms. I think I'm going to have to drop that. <laughs> Oh, I was just saying it earlier a little bit ago. It's like, no, no way I could do this solo. I said, nope, I needed 50 followers before I ever tried it. 
uh, I said, no way, I'm never going to try this. And then I actually played with um, my nephew and that first stream and second stream, third stream, fourth stream, it was so much fun. Thank you for following so much, Fireman. Thank you. Um, no, I mean, we had an absolute blast and I died so many times, but it was fun. So uh, just one night, like he couldn't, he couldn't be on. So I was like, well, I'm going to do it myself. Yes, I saw dots. Um, and I was just like, yeah, it's like, let me, let me try it solo. And uh, I put on my uh, heart rate monitor and it was perfect. It was a fantastic stream. Like, I loved it. Every single bit of it. And I've been, and I'm still playing it. I've narrowed it down to one house that I like though. <laughs> Someone was running. Yes, that was dots. That was the dots projector. I don't know what it stands for. But see, he said he was far, but he clearly was right there. So can a deal a deal can't move rooms. I think this might be a deal. Um, what else can we do to eliminate? Well, let's try the wraith check. And motion sensor. Do we need motion sensor? We need EMF. Oh, dang it. You need the MF. Um, I, here, I'll, I'll, I'll actually show you. I would put, son of a bitch, I killed the breaker. Um, ah, oh, jeez. Yeah, it killed the breaker, but it's in the room with the breaker, so that's a butt. Um, I'll still show you. I'd put a camera here, but this is what it looks at. It's actually easier. Oh shit, I'm in the wrong area. Wraith check. Um, I forgot the breakers downstairs. Um, it can actually teleport. Like they don't physically move. They kind of just appear in different rooms at will. I didn't open that. Oh, okay. That, that was me. So we can kind of just pop up into a different room if it wants to. Um, but this one is not moving rooms. It is definitely sitting still. Um, we'll turn this on because I don't believe it's ghost orbs. What is it interacting with? The door? Okay. Oh, Jesus. That's a ghost. Oh, shit. That's an Ah, get away from it. <laughs> that's a ghost ball coming after me. Okay. That's all that was, was the ghost ball. Okay. So that right there was a ghost, a ghost event. Oh my God. Why is this sitting right here? This is scary. Ooh, it could be a wraith. Ghosts don't interact with the lights on? That is not true. Only a couple of them don't, actually. Um, because I can do this. Give me a sign. I say if it's a shade, it will not interact when I'm in the room. But every other ghost can interact with the lights on. Give me a sign. I think this is actually a um wraith. Let's grab the other salt. Because it did a ghost event and it did not step in that salt. I think we might have figured this one out. Oh, we got the EMF reader. Cool. That's right. We got the bonus. That gives me an extra 10 bucks. Yay. Risk your life for 10 bucks. Do that every day. 75%. <laughs> I've already given him the crucifixes. He, he knows about it. Wow, it had a limp. I don't think I've ever seen a ghost with a limp. Uh, let's grab this because it is walking around there and it did not step in that salt. I think we have a wraith. I think we have a wraith. <laughs> um, if you <laughs> if you really want to see spooky, uh, check out my part. 10 it was two parts ago whatnot uh it's on twitch it's on youtube and whatnot 
um, I did the randomizer wheel. So I did, um, I put zero sanity and all like starter items and stuff like that on the wheel. And the first, it, if it couldn't have been any better, I spun zero sanity twice in a row. And if you want to see hunts and stuff, you want to see me scared, there you go. <laughs> the tarot roulette was definitely the funniest one where I picked up the tarot card and died. This thing is a wraith. It's a wraith. It is refusing to step in the salt. It is refusing to step in the salt. <laughs> it's a wraith. Give me a sign. I mean, I'll shut off the lights just to prove it. Give me a sign. Can you... Give me a sign? I mean, I'll stand over here with it. All right, well, let's do this. Give me a sign. Can you give me a sign? You moved. Well, let's double check. So, a wraith can teleport, but this is still its room. This is definitely still its room. Ooh, the temperature just went up. Did we think it moved? I think we moved. I think we moved, but I don't think we moved far. We moved into here. No? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. It moved over here and it didn't step in that salt. It's not... This thing's not giving me anything, though. Where is this cursed item? That's what I gotta find. If there's a cursed item, I gotta find it. Um... I've already checked. It's not tarot. Uh... Could it be downstairs? Where's the other spawn points? No. That was a locker. Yeah, so it's still interacting with stuff in here. Where's my fingerprints thing? I didn't even grab it. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. <laughs> I never grabbed the fingerprints. <laughs> I threw it on the middle of the truck and I never grabbed it. Yeah, this one's not very spooky because it's not doing anything. I would say that sucks, but it's actually like, I'm not even worried about this one right now because at this point I got salt down and I know it's a wraith. Wraith cannot step in salt. So a wraith can teleport around, but it cannot step in salt. I could kill the breaker and then it couldn't teleport. Uh, it's not a bad idea. Can you give me a sign? Yeah, here's what we're going to do. Give me a sign. I don't want it teleporting around, so since I'm pretty dang sure it's a wraith, let's go shut off the breaker. Because you notice it's interacting with things when I'm not there. Um... So doing this will prevent the Wraith from teleporting. So it would be stuck in this room. Give me a sign. Show yourself. I'm not seeing fingerprints. Okay, it's... Yeah, it's not doing anything now because I've shut off the breaker. Arr, take that. Take that, Wraith. Alright, what'd you say here? Time a friend of mine was playing this and pissing the ghost off and it helped him know what the ghost was. Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, I did that on my last part too. I uh, yelled at the ghost and I told it it was a bitch, and then it, uh, it immediately ghost defended and chased after me. <laughs> and I said, okay, don't do that again. <laughs> It was it was pretty good. <laughs> um, all right. Well, Mr. Wraith, you are my last ghost of the night. Thank you for showing up. <laughs> Wraiths are easy. Yeah, it's not disturbing those salt piles at all. Um, let's see. Ugh, rates are not easy though to get a picture. Uh, cleanse the area. Oh, smudge stick. Let, yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and get that bonus objective. Oops. Eh, I take that too. Why not? Go ahead and get that bonus objective. And taking a picture of it is going to be practically impossible. And let's just go ahead and get this bonus 10. I think Wraiths is fingerprints, but eh, it's barely touching anything now. And I mean, these salt piles are undisturbed. Smudge it. Let's go ahead and double check for fingerprints one more time. Um, This one's brighter. Give me a sign. Was that my breath or was that the locker? Locker, it was not. Okay. Yeah, I'm not seeing fingerprints. I think it's just a stubborn fingerprint. Give me a sign. I don't think this guy's gonna interact unless it's uh, unless I'm low enough sanity. It's not doing anything. That's all right. I like the timid ghosts when I already know what it is. When you already know what it is, it's nice. Is that a salt pile disturbed? No. No, because there's three right there. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Well, we got our smudge. So the last thing would be to capture a picture. Mm. Yeah. Let's, let's go ahead and try it. Ah, what the hell? Let's do that. I mean, we're still at 90% sanity. This thing can't hunt me. Until at least, um, 70. Probably 30 for Wraith. Give me a sign. All right, show yourself. Show yourself. Can you show yourself? You're on candid camera? Show yourself. I don't like when they go quiet like this. Because now I'm worried it might have moved rooms. Where is the other... I don't know where the other um, cursed items are. I just don't like running around in the dark. Um, no, no. Ooh, 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 it's doing something. It's doing something. Doing something. Show yourself. Show yourself. Not that. <laughs> don't show that. Wraith. Show yourself. You know, it is absolutely crazy. Sometimes I get the ones who just don't pop up at all. Oh my god. <laughs> Freaking Mozart's back again. <laughs> all right, well. I don't think we're going to get a ghost event out of that unless I drain my sanity. We got, we, we got Wraith. It's late, I gotta call it there, so. At least I figured it out. So I only got two wrong tonight, that wasn't bad. Forced a couple of hunts. 
Yeah, I mean, I knew that was a wraith as soon as I kind of went in there and it did something like it did the uh, ghost or not the ghost orb, the um, uh, but the airball event, the airball event. As soon as it did that, I kind of figured out what it was. Oh, nice. Complete objectives daily. Sweet. Um, let's double check which uh, evidence we did miss. Because, I mean, we, we proved that it was a wraith right away because we saw that it did this thing. Okay, so it did teleport once. Okay. That that explains. So as soon as they went into the house, the uh, the sink was on. I think it was the sink was on. So I thought it was in that bathroom. Um, so it teleported after I did the... Um, After I turned on the breaker. Uh, two events. So it did two air balls, and that's all it did. That's crazy. So it was only out, out of its own room for 21 seconds. So that thing did not move very far at all. Oh, that was one of the least active of a wraith that I've had. That's, uh, that's interesting. Um, yeah, let's just double check what evidence we missed. Because I'm... I just want to learn this game like kind of inside and out so that if I play with randoms, I'm not, you know, going to panic and just run right into a door. <laughs> so I'm kind of learning like I, I would love to be able to get one evidence and be like, well, I know it's between these three. Like that's kind of what I'm trying to figure out. Um, EMF five. Yeah, EMF five. Okay, so I did see EMF five on the uh, activity meter. Then I did see it. I just I marked it off and I said no, it's probably not EMF five. Can't be tracked with footprints. Yeah, I didn't hear any footprints either. I I should have thought of that. I didn't hear any footprints. Yeah. All right, and then well, another successful run there hold on one second i've got so many screens i have to flip around here uh let me stop this real quick uh i have to say good night to youtube here good night youtube if you would like to hear more of my chats it's uh, on twitch so too bad so sad you have to watch it on twitch night youtube